prior to the Watchman device, I suffered side effects from blood thinning uh, treatment. The risk of using blood thinners can be uh, irritation to the skin. You also have a bleed risk. Uh, it can cause lightheadedness. Without those things, the Watchman device has really changed my life in the sense that I don't have those side effects anymore. So over the last two decades, we have been investigating an alternative method to try to prevent stroke in patients with atrial fibrillation, but using a mechanical intervention rather than pharmacological. And instead of giving the patients blood thinner, we ask them to undergo treatment with the Watchman device, which is an umbrella filter, small catheter-based that gets placed through a groin incision into the left heart, into a chamber called the appendage, where most of the clots reside and try to occlude it like as if we cork it with this watchman. And with this once in a lifetime method, you can take 90% of the repository where clots are in atrial fibrillation out of the circulation. Nick uh, came to us uh, for the first time about three years ago seeking this therapy. Prior to this diagnosis, I was not able to get around the house. I was not able to walk upstairs. Some of the common things everyday people take for granted. He was a, an active person, or he is still an active person, a surfer, that wanted to continue his active lifestyle, but was really limited and was afraid to do anything because of the need for oral anticoagulation. I really love the idea that I'll be able to snowboard this season and I'll be able to surf and I'll be able to do all the outdoor things that I love to do uh, going moving forward. My prediction is that half the people who are otherwise eligible and who do have atrial fibrillation, being old or young, will end up having the watchman uh, because of the uh, safety profile, the effectiveness, and the freedom from anticoagulation, there's no doubt in my mind. The Watchman device is indeed a, a lifesaver and a game changer. <music>